welcome back. We talked earlier about education as a key factor in our economic prospects, but there's also health care. Scott Waller, it's not only a key industry, industrial factor here, uh, but uh, it's also a condition that directly impacts the availability of our workforce. Talk a little bit about the importance of health care and what impact well, it has. With, without question, a healthy workforce is vital for us to be able to, to make sure that we're providing the type of workforce that businesses are going to need. And when we think about how we, how we go about doing that, there are a variety of things that we want to look at. Health and wellness is, is a big part of what we talk about. You know, MEC is very lucky that over the last 15 years we have been able to go out on the road with our MEC road show, our, our tour that we do. And, and our sponsor, Blue Cross and Blue Shield, is sponsoring it not because of the marketing side of it, because they want to be able to stress the importance of, of what it means to have that healthy workforce. And it begins with, it begins with the preventive care, it begins with being able to uh, address issues early that, that may uh, keep people from missing time on the job or address issues so that you can deal with, with serious illnesses or diseases that one may happen. So as we look at this, the more that we can understand the importance of it and how making sure we have access to health care in a way that, that our, our working Mississippians can, can benefit from that is extremely important to make sure that we're really understanding why it matters and it matters because it, it's all about creating the availability of a workforce that matches the skills that we're able to teach them from a workforce training or educational perspective that gives you a complete uh, sense of ability to come to Mississippi set up shop have the workforce available be here to expand your business and have the workforce available as we go forward. Uh, Commissioner, you've dealt with a plenty of health care policy at, when you were in the Senate. Is our precarious state of health in Mississippi holding us back from greater prosperity? It is. When, when, when you look at our health care situation in the state of Mississippi, special rule uh, and the availability and access and affordability. Uh, we're currently looking at some of our hospitals in the Mississippi Delta, uh, Greenville, Greenwood, Clarksdale, that have been, been, been challenged uh, due to uh, finances and other kinds of problems that's being created. To see those hospitals struggling and the threat of the possibility of losing them creates even more severe problems. In addition to that, when you look at the cost, inflation mm -hmm. for transportation, to be able to move our citizens to health care and get the services they need, those kind of things are very challenging and very problematic for the state of Mississippi and the workforce because if you don't have a healthy workforce, it's going to create problems with productivity. It's going to create problems with recruitment. Uh, it creates problems in all er areas as, as far as business opportunities and economic development and community growth. Commissioner Willie Seaman and Scott Wall with NBC, thanks again for joining us tonight.